today I'll be making for you smothered oven smothered pork chops you seasoned up and smothered in the oven but using Chris's authentic Jamaican jerk the idea behind that is to show you how the jerk sauce can be used as a seasoning to season up your food. It don't necessarily mean you have to go outside and light up the grill to use it. So here is the jerk. I'm, I'm putting it all over it. Rubbing it all in. Rub it in. Rub it in. Nice. Look how nice that is. Yeah, man. Look on that pork there. Only four pieces made though for my lunch today. Here I'm braising the pork chops, just lightly browning them before I put them in the oven to smother them in gravy. So I lightly flour them so they don't stick to the pot. I use one tablespoon of coconut oil and I'm just browning them. Some ketchup, tomato ketchup. Black pepper. A little bit of salt. Add about a cup of water and I'm going to put it in the oven. There it is. There it is. Sizzling. Sizzling. I'm going to put it in the oven. Here I'm making um, honey glazed carrots and green beans. So I started out with a teaspoon of um, maybe, yeah, a teaspoon of coconut oil. So I sauteed them up in the in the oil, and then now I'm adding just a tad bit of honey. We're not trying to get them too sweet. We're just trying to glaze them, just glazing them a little bit, and there they go. So this is my complete plate. I have pork chops that just came out the oven. Look at the pork chops that just came out. Look how beautiful those are. Look at that gravy. And then I had some rasta pasta. I added some rasta pasta with some fresh par with some parsley flakes. Some parsley flakes, some parmesan cheese. So this is my plate. It I go nice. So it's the rasta pasta, the pork chops, the glazed carrots with the green beans, my little um, flower garnishes.